tackled by Davis. Good little pass though to Andrew Conway and it opens us up for the winger. Dialende outside him and the pass inside to Jack O'Donoghue. And the counter-attack by Munster delivers the first try of the game. It's going well for Munster, ever closer to the line. Try given! Oh, we do have a game here at Parker Scarlett. What a comeback by 14-man Munster. Kevin O'Byrne, the try scorer. Now it needs Ben Healy. I think he's to got it. it. Well, again, he has. We're all square at Parker Scarlett. 27 points apiece. Effort. And they've got the penalty. 20, no release. 20, no release. Yes, it is. 27 points to 17, Munster trailed, this to win the game, has it got the legs, oh my word that is fantastic, oh Munster race towards Ben Healy, the replacement outside half, look at this for a celebration. Here they come again with Gavin Coombs, Jack O'Donoghue, James Cronin, Keep your feet 77th minute here, Salanoa again. No way through for Kevin O'Byrne, CJ Stander, so dangerous, so difficult to stop, and so strong from two metres out. And the monster captain, Pyle, drives his way over the try line. It's all on the shoulders now of Ben Healy, and he gets the conversion. Here comes the momentum, Cardiff not set well here at all, try line beckons. The try line is breached. Really good execution from Kevin O'Byrne by the ball defence from Cardiff. Sadly lacking there. They were never set to deal with that surge forward. Munster's attack momentarily grinds to a halt and then it's off again. Deal Andy. Oh, Sweden gets it away. Scuttle. Oh, unbelievable try. Absolutely brilliant out of Munster. And finished off by JJ Andrahan. Klein. Kick through. Oh, this could be a glorious score. It is indeed for Calvin Nash. Lovely little kick through from Rory Scannell. Point lead of Munster. Lineup functions well again. Pre plan move, Delande. Oh, lovely little drift on the outside. And this is going to be a second score for the fullback, Matt Gallagher. And a third try for Munster. Picked up and hoovered up instead by Haley, and Haley goes through the gap, and Haley goes through the gears, and Haley scores for Munster. Munster get the penalty, and they tap and go, and it's that man again. Oh, what a game he's having! More defending to do for the Warriors. This time it's Coombs with the take at the front, and they try to get them all going, breaking off the side of it, and he's got there. Munster had the first try. Everyone relax, everyone relax. Take your own players. Off first phase ball and it's Thank skipper Billy Holland Give who's got yeah, there. Hands up. Now they have another dig at the line. And one more with O'Donoghue. Who just can't quite wrestle the ball over but they have now. Munster celebrate a third try. And it is that man, Gavin Coombs! The opening two games of the Guinness Pro 14, he finds Jack O'Donoghue. Oh, little kick over the top, all on the points here, and it's perfect. Absolutely perfect for Dan Goggin. Switch back inside, oh, that's very nice. Really nice between the half-backs, and it's going to result in a try. Wonderful execution and invention, sleight of hand. Siciliano was over it and making it. Very, very slow ball for Munster. Hanrahan pops one over the top to Goggin. They may well get another try here. And it's a really, really nice finish to the game. And a try for Thomas O'Hearn in the corner. Liam Coombs, it's another advantage. A little flick on the inside, and over they go through Darren Sweetnam, who gets the try for Munster. And the men from the south do finish on a high. The whole team did no game last week. This is a good result for Munster. And for Ulster, 
think it's a win, but a bonus point would have been nice. Jack Crowley with the conversion, very tight scoreline. Murray assesses the options and there is space and he finds space and the first try comes in the 19th minute from Chris Farrell. Good contact, lovely connection. The only little puff of breeze there is around Thomas Park is behind JJ Hanran. That's a really, really good strike. What a start that is for the monster fly half JJ Hanrahan. The ball's a little bit slow. Scott Hardy's on the wrong side. How does referee Andrew Brace see that? It's okay to continue. Ty Byrne for the line and have they driven him over? Very, very close there. The support player arrived to the ball carrier Jean Klein and Ty Byrne. The two lock forwards working in tandem. It's a long competition. It'll kick over the top. Where's this one off to? And it's going to be grounded, I think. Well, Darren Sweetenham is latched onto that one, and I think on first viewing that that's going to be awarded as a try. It should have been dealt with by the Benetton defence. Hayward watched it, comes off his knee, and then it's grounded. It goes to Riera, but it's intercepted out wide by Liam Coombs, and Coombs pops it back inside, and McCarthy's away, and Munster are almost going to get there. They have got there, it's Scannell. Niall Scannell in for Munster's second try. Still time. The ball was there. Back in the pocket is Hanrahan. Drop a goal to win it. Would you believe it? Would you believe that? The final play of the game. Georgia again in there digging deep. It's Scannell. Jean Klein from the second row, that inevitability to this third match, but Kuta has been just as good as seven for Munster. And it's the Munster forwards who may have the final say. This is an excellent driving maul. Darren Sweetnam is tempted to come in, he's, he's in. Welcome back, Joey. Looks pretty good. Almost burrowing his way on the Dublin Park turf towards that Connacht try line. Can they even the game up here from close range? That looks pretty good. Mike Haley's off in chase here, and he's got it in the second attempt. And now he's got a little bit of space. Haley digs one in behind, all on the points, and can he collect it? Mike Haley for the line. That's brilliant from the Munster fullback. Carberry splits the uprights and it's seven points in the bag for Munster. Ball was a little bit slow to arrive to it. Now McCarthy puts it through the hands. The Allende so powerful and strong in that Advantage position. Munster have been in this five-meter channel for about ten minutes now. Advantage can they get a five-pointer? Yes, they can. Carberry with a little bit of time and he can be very dangerous in these kind of situations. Picks his way through the traffic. Carberry now up to that score and it's 22. Gets his pass away. Can they stop Shane Daly? Absolutely not. And there is a little bit of a flash of exactly what Munster and Irish rugby have been missing in Joey Carberry. It's going to have to come round from the right hand side, but it's uh, on a string at the moment for Joey Carberry. And get his hands on the ball, it's there for McCarthy again. There was a little bit of space out wide. Oh, it's a lovely little exchange of passes. And Munster get in with a try. Put down the drive. Now, can they force their way over that? It's certain to be a try, and it is a try. 58 minute in, relentless pressure from Munster, and well, he's only been on the park about two minutes, and Roman Salanoa gets Munster's third try of the evening. Yeah, that's good stuff from Daly and over the top, and now into the wide expanse for Coombs. So many options on the inside. Healy gets in for the bonus point try.